everyone, thanks again for watching. We just did the crossbow challenge with all the English referees, all the British referees, I have to say. And now we have to get ready for our finals because I've got the girls 15s final and my good mate Daniel Richardson has got the boys 19s. Yep. How are you doing Dan? Happy? Yeah, I'm happy. Uh, the weather's cooled off a little bit. Um, just looking forward to it now, Rob, to just want to get up to the stadium, watch your game and um, obviously get prepared for my own game. Liam's on me line, also from Wales, and I've got Carwin as well, who's with me, and uh, Matty Lockton's uh, fourth official, so no, it should be good, should be a good laugh, well, main thing is we just go out there and enjoy it, that's the main thing. You're looking forward to yours, Rob? Yeah, I'm absolutely looking forward to my final. Uh, I haven't got Dutch linesmen this year, yeah. I've got two linesmen from Finland, yeah. and I have a fourth official from England, yeah. so mm. I'm looking forward to it, it's kind of similar like last year, yeah. we both had a final, and... I'll finish my final, then you came on. Yeah. Uh, it's the same now. Yeah. All the British referees are going to watch the game. You, you start it and I'll finish it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Absolutely looking forward to it. Um, everyone else is getting ready to go back home. Yeah. People have got final uh, packing their things and going back. Yeah. Uh, we are going to stay a bit longer because we have a final tonight, steakhouse. And Dan made me a promise that if he gets the boys 19s, he's going to buy me steak. So I've got to buy him steak. Yeah. So, I don't uh, mind, I don't mind. Listen, I'm a man of my word. Rob actually forgot about the bet, and I actually reminded him this morning, didn't I, Rob? What a good man, right? What a good man. Yeah, so I'm looking forward to my free steak. I'm looking forward to my final as well. Yeah. Daniel, best of luck. And you, mate. We will be flogging on the way to the stadium, have a nice chat about the games, exactly. and good luck to you. Thank you, mate. And you. Rob? Yeah? We're on our way, mate. We are. We're on our way to the stadium. Your thoughts on uh, your game coming up? I'm looking forward to it, man. Yeah. It's fantastic to have a final again. Of course, you don't come for a final, but it's absolutely fantastic. Um, the weather's nice, just like last year. It's uh, 25 degrees at the moment, so yeah. I think that's nice compared to last year when it was 30 degrees. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm uh, looking forward to it. I'm really curious about the teams, curious about my linesman from Finland, uh, and of course, my Ford official from England. But we're gonna smash it. We're gonna own the pitch for 50 minutes. Brilliant. And we're just gonna to go to the back there. We got Kaz and Liam, who are with me on the boys 19s final. Thoughts, lads? I'm saying no. Buzzing, bro. It's just cool for now. Excitement, excitement. Everyone's buzzing. Matt Lachlan, fourth official. Anything yeah, for the really, vlog? Really, really looking forward to it. It's gonna be great working with Dan and the Welsh boys. Um, really big game. Buzzing for it. So there you can see, and as you can see, Rob, the weather is absolutely beautiful still. It's probably not as hot as what we've had all week, yeah. which is a bit of a relief for us, if we're sure being is. honest. But um, <clears throat> we'll uh, take another vlog when we get to the stadium in about five minutes. Sure will. Take care, everyone. <laughs> so here we are, we've just arrived at the stadium. During. Rob's just going to get all the stuff out. Get the stuff out, lads, help him out. There you go. As you can see, the lads all getting their stuff out of the boot. Rob, yeah, we've arrived at the stadium. Mate. We've arrived at the stadium, mate. Yeah. Beautiful day. Excited. Good to be back. Yeah, we just drove up to the stadium. You can see the lights. Certain feeling in your body. Like the yeah. stadium looks brilliant behind you, doesn't it? Yeah, they've improved the stadium this year. There's more stands, so it's even better than last year. I uh, can't wait, man. How about you? Yeah, brilliant, mate. My team are here. We've got team Team Wales here, and Englishman, fourth official. We're gonna go out and smash it. The weather's beautiful. They're looking excited. Rob, we'll catch up inside. I'm just coming up to the end of the boys under 17s final. Still nil nil. I'm just going to try and catch a small word with Rob the Whip. Rob, hey. just caught you at the right time, mate. Absolutely. It looked like we're going to go into extra time here. Yeah. Um, how are you feeling? Preparing well? I'm preparing well. My assistants and Ford official are ready. Hello. Hello from Finland. Finland. Oh, Finland yes. And from my town's Fourth Eng official from England. England. Hello, from everybody. Finland? Yes. Enjoy. Thank you. Rob. Yeah. Your last thoughts on the game? Words on the game. Yeah. Enjoy it. 
Yeah. It's not about us today, it's about the girls. They've reached the final, they want to win it. We have a ball? Enjoy yourselves. Do we have a ball? It's going to be fantastic. Brilliant. Rob, enjoy the game. Thank you. You start it Cheers. and I'll finish it. Fantastic. Nice one, mate. Thank you. Walking into the dressing room now. After the Wales lads and of course my friend from England have finished their game. Let's start with the referee. How did you do? First half went really, really well. Uh, not much happened. Really good, really good performance. Um, overall, I thought the team did really, really well. Obviously, one talking point was a was a penalty which made it one 0 But again, like other years, we'll have to look at it on the replay, see whether it was or whether it wasn't. Live, I thought that's an easy penalty for me. But listen, um, we'll see it back. But overall, finished two one. Uh, to Norway, or Denmark, Norway, 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 Norway. one, two, one. Um, no complaints at full time. Everybody seemed really, really happy. I thought the lads, for their ages, 17 and 18 year olds, to perform like that in that heat was absolutely brilliant. So I think the boys deserve some credit as well. Absolutely. So Matt, Matt was on. Liam and Cass. First boys 19s, first final at Dyna Cup. Let's start with you, Liam. Great, awesome experience. Loved it, being with the best boys as well, so I can't fault anything really. Tired now? Not nah, good. That's good, that's good. That means you worked hard. Of course. What about you? We're looking forward to yeah, our state, but well, um, probably the best game I've done in a long time. Maybe the best I ever. It was probably the best ref I've ever done as well, to be fair to him. Um, but yeah, amazing experience and take nothing away from it. Being on a live telly, is that the first time for you? You don't count the news, yeah. Fantastic, congratulations. <laughs> We've also got a Ford official. Yeah. And before the game we thought, he's probably not going to have anything to do, but you did. What happened? Yeah, uh, there was an incident. Ball, ball came off um, into, the, into the opposing technical area. Um, I spoke to, to Steve and Dan on the, on the comm. <laughs> and um, basically the coach wanted to... Wanted to uh, it was a bit of argy bargy. A bit of argy bargy. Let him talk. Let him talk. It's okay because our, our great tournament organiser, Torsten, came in and uh, man out. managed to physically separate the situation. <laughs> Uh, which helped. <laughs> Torsten done his job. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah which in all seriousness, really listen, really in all good. seriousness, it's finished 2 1. Nobody's complaining at full time. We've done a job. I couldn't be any more happy. I couldn't be any more proud of the lads. So, and thanks for all you boys for coming over to support us as well. Yeah, no problem. It means a lot. It means a lot. Likewise, guys, you have every reason to be proud. Roll on good on game. Here. Make Wales proud. See you later. Cheers, Rob. Nice right. See ya. Right, right. See you later, Rob. Oh. Okay, Hi, Steve. Hello. Second half just, just went, didn't it? So, so here we are. Down the top of the 19, Rob. Yeah. We've just got back, got changed. We're, uh, we both refereed our finals. We did. Uh, how was your game? What's good? 3-2. Uh, two. two penalties. Two clear penalties. Unlike last year, no comments about the penalty, so I'm happy. Uh, I had to work with two Finnish referees. Yeah, how were official they? official from England. Uh, well, some of their signals were not the same as we would use, uh, but it was nice to work with different countries. Let's put it that way. Uh, and in the end, I think the right team has won, so yeah. happy. And what was the score, Rob? 3-2, it finished. Uh, that sounds like a very exciting game. It wasn't, because 3-0 uh, first. Then 3 1, very nice goal uh, in the first half. Second half, uh, last minute, I gave a penalty. Funny situation because first um, they said it was a handball, and I said no, and then there was a foul right afterwards. Yeah. So I gave the penalty straight away. So uh, that was really hilarious. Yeah, really enjoyed it. So you're looking forward to coming back next year? Listen, I'll be coming back as long as I'm alive. Yeah. How was your final, boys 19? Yeah, absolutely brilliant. Uh, great team performance. A little bit of controversy over a penalty decision, but we've since seen the replay. And I can confirm, it was a penalty. So look, it just shows you, doesn't it? You're happy? I'm happy. How about your assistants? Assistants, 
the boys there, 17 and 18 years old, years of age, and I'll be honest with you, I couldn't have been any more proud of them. Uh, like I said, great team performance. Look forward to bringing them back next year, and uh, they'll be even better referees next year than they were this year. So, so I don't even and I have to ask you about coming back next year because you've just given me odds. Next year is my tenth year coming. Am Same. I ever going to miss it? Rob? We're never, we're never going to miss it. We're never going to miss it's it. It's going to be talking about it. It's like a religion to us, isn't it? It is. You know, it is. Just... It's hard to explain though. It is. It is. Because people always think it's about the tournament. It's about the family, about the friendships, yeah. the other referees. And listen, we are going to be part of the furniture at Dharma Cup here in Europe. I'm definitely going to make it 30, 40 years in a row here in Fjorin, northern Denmark. You've got just unbelievable, isn't it? It is. Anyway, we're off to the stadium to watch a couple more boys from England, referee, boys under 16's final. And then we're off to the steakhouse where we'll probably go. Yeah, probably we will. See you all there. See you later. Bye. Right. Well, that's it. Last vlog of Cop 2019. I can't believe it's over. It's been a long week. It's been a really long week. Uh, 14 games each, I think we've wrecked. Yeah, 14. Um, mostly boys 19s, mostly boys under 17s. But it's absolutely unbelievable. It's just, it keeps getting better and better as you can see in the stadium. You know, look at the stand. That, that wasn't even there two years ago. It wasn't. You just turn that round, Dad. That stand, that stand behind the goal. And there's even a message on the big screen. I don't know if you can see that. Welcome back to Dana Cup in 2020. Well, one thing's for sure, I'll be back. Rob will be back. We'll all be back. Adam, I'm sure you'll be back. Um, but like you said, where's the week gone? It's just, it's crazy. You arrive in Denmark, you'll be like, oh yeah, it's going to be a nice week, and then you snap your fingers, yeah. and the week's gone. But yeah. listen, this year we've had amazing games. Boys 19s, boys 16s. You've got the boys 19s final, the highest final you can get at Dark Cup. No one will take that experience away from you. And you did well, your boys did well. Did so, Wales proud. What I else like, do you want? I like to think we did Wales proud. I've seen the replay. I'm really happy with my performance now. Over the moon. Yeah. Rob, you had a couple of decisions in your game. Yeah. You've obviously seen the replays. Happy Absolutely. with your decisions. I'm really happy. And at the end of the day, you know, we, we, when we get given a final, we've got to get the big decisions right. There's no need for VAR when we're Rob. No need for it, Rob. You know? Absolutely. All of us is We don't need it. We don't need it.